Hello from Railroad Square in downtown Santa Rosa, California. Today it is the fourth annual Hand Car Regatta. The Hand Car Regatta is an event that's held, been held here in Railroad Square for the last four years. And as I understand it, this is actually going to be the last Hand Car Regatta. And one of the interesting things about this event it's the costumes that you see people wearing. And they have these, they have these contests, and the, what, what, what happens is these people put together these hand-powered vehicles, if you will, that compete on the railroad tracks. And they, just off the wall, they, they put together these off the wall uh, vehicles, and they, powered by foot or by, uh, by hand or whatever. Um, and they compete. Uh, I think they have different time trials. So the, it's a great event. Unfortunately, I think this is the last year that they're going to have it because they're developing what's called the Smart Train up here in Northern California, which is supposed to help ease the traffic congestion in Northern California going from here down to the San Francisco Bay Area. So we've got two tickets that somebody was kind to, uh, kindly enough to give to us. And with that, we're going to go ahead and explore this great event. So let's go and let's have some fun. All right, so here we are. We're inside the hand car regatta. And one of my favorite food vendors here are these people, Gerald's, Gerard's Paella. Gerard's Paella. And you can find their website at www.gerardsparac.com. Paella.com, and they have these large, large pots, and they've got some really good stuff in here. Look at that shrimp. Looks like shrimp, rice, peppers. It's called paella. So, and as I just learned, the uh, the style of clothing that you see here, it's called uh, steam punk, like steam engine and punk. And somebody told me that it kind of originated or it's evolved from the, the Burning Man Festival that happens every year up in uh, the Nevada desert. So we're going to kind of walk through the crowd and check this out. Should be a good, uh, should be a great event actually. It's not too hot. Years past, it's been really, really hot and uncomfortable for a lot of these people wearing these outfits. But uh, this year, I, I think it's. Um, it's absolutely ideal. Here are some folks sitting in front of the Opportunity Stage, so, uh, where different uh, people come here, up and perform. The gentleman yes, back there. Yes, we are, yes. My name is Josh, and um, <clears throat> I'm directing the music here, and I'm also the education director of the Hand Car Regatta. It's an educational event, and we are uh, all right, so I like to just walk through the crowd and uh, just let you get a feel of what this is all like. All right, so you can see there's a great turnout here at the Hand Car Regatta, and these are some of the vendors or displays. There's somebody, uh, a group there showing you how beer and cheese is made. And we come down here, here's another booth talking about preserves. And right beyond there, you have what's called the Opportunity Stage, where different people can get up and perform. Here's a booth, Ask a Vegan. Right there. If you have any questions about being a vegan, that's where you want to go to ask. Okay. So we're just going to walk through the crowd here and let you get a, a feel as if you were here yourself. Here's somebody on a... Uh, I don't know what this is. It's kind of a weird looking device. It's got some antlers on it. Just taking a ride through the crowd. I think one of the things that I enjoy about doing these videos is that it allows it allows people to meet uh, you know guys like this guy, Mr. Uh, Mr. Sal. How you Hi, doing, Tom. Sal? Good, how are you? I'm good. I'm doing a video for YouTube. People around the world can uh, tune in and see what the hand car regatta is all about. I'm one wow. of the dead people. You're one of the what? I'm one of the dead people. Yeah? <laughs> all right. Good to see you. All right, Bye. All right. Sal's a guy that I've known for uh, quite some time. Great guy. 
Some ladies dressed in some nice outfits there. Hello, ladies. Hello. Thank you. This is called steampunk, right? Yes. Okay. Yeah. So uh, tomorrow or maybe the next day, if you go on Google and type in Hand Car Regatta Santa Rosa, or go on YouTube rather, you'll see yourselves. Yeah. So is oh, this is you. this one of the only times that you dress like this? Um, other than going out in the city and stuff, this is probably. So you, the city for people around the world, the city is San Francisco. Yes. So you, are there clubs in San Francisco where you can go and dress like this and hang out, or? Yeah, there's lots of places where you can go. There's lots of different people in its own community. All right. Well, have a great day. You too. Have a good day. This is actually one of the more fun events that's held here in Santa Rosa each year. One of my favorite events that's held here each year is the Peggy Sue Cruise that's held. But this is fun to come to and just uh, check out all the different different types of people. With a bunch of kids doing the whole, they have the whole hula hoop, uh, looks like they have hula hoop rentals here. A lot of fun, hoops for sale. So you can just pick up a hula hoop and go give it a shot. Hello, young lady. Are you able to hula hoop? Huh? Give it a shot there. You go, girl. Looks like that. You're pretty good at that. I know. I can look at it. All right. Somebody having a lot of fun with the hula hoops. And here is uh, Charlie Brown. This is the uh, hometown of Charles Schultz, the uh, creator of the Peanuts characters. There's a stage up there where some people are performing. So let's uh, keep walking. Here's an interesting looking character. He's dressed up as, uh, he's got all the garb there. All right, and some nice chow to eat. Let's just keep walking. Here's some more vendors. Santa Rosa really is a wonderful place to, to live. Some old-fashioned cattle corn being sold. Some interesting characters here. Would you like to come to our haunted house? We're always dying for a few more fresh faces. Oh, here's an interesting uh, performer that should be great addition to the video. Woman playing a violin while standing on a ball. I think that's a woman. Yeah, sure it is. Oh, and she's whistling. be really impressed if she were balancing something on her head while she was balancing on the ball and playing the violin and singing. 
Now that would really be something. But uh, maybe next year. She'll practice and work on Oh, she is doing that. She's got something balanced on her head, playing the instrument and singing, and she's got it all going on. She's going to be a YouTube sensation. Some interesting folks here. Hello, ladies. Are you having a nice afternoon? Yes, we are. Very nice. Ah, good. All right. You see all types here. It really is a great, uh, great experience. And there's Marilyn Monroe. Uh-huh. I say that's Marilyn Monroe because she, uh, dresses up as Marilyn Monroe quite a bit. She's at a lot of these, she's at a lot of these functions and uh, the Peggy Sue crew, she's always dressed up as Marilyn Monroe. All right. There's some interesting folks here. So let's uh, take a break here, and I'm going to go enjoy some of the. I'm going to go enjoy some of the festivities myself, without the camera. Here's a nice, uh, nice costume that a lady's wearing. What she got there? Looks like a weapon of some sort. Are you ready? Uh huh. Okay. All right, so let's go enjoy the uh, enjoy the day, and we'll be back. All right, here is a elephant cruising through the crowd here. All right, here's another area of the festival, the hand car regatta. Going to do a quick pan. We've pretty much covered the whole thing here. Could stay here for several hours just walking around and people watching. And there's some ladies that are associated with what's called the Blind Scream Haunted House. Sure is an interesting event that they have here. You know, years ago I would have thought that the majority of these people that are all dressed up like this are strange and uh, over the years I've come to learn that they're not strange they're just different and that's what uh, this makes us all wonderful and what makes uh, life wonderful is how everybody is just different and they can express themselves the way that they wish to now they can't do that in every country in the world mind you but uh, here in the greatest country of the world, the United States of America, they certainly can. And I hope it stays that way for a long, long time. So goodbye from the 2011 hand car regatta. Okay, so here is the main attraction of the hand car regatta. These are the hand cars, and they're going to be racing down these tracks. And again, you can see the great crowd. Guns up. We're going to start our first race. Here we go. For the Never Was crew, we have uh, Vicky and Dave and Shannon and Joe pedaling. We're so happy to have them with us today. They also do the motorized couch contraptions that you can check out online. Motorizedcouch.com. Really cool stuff. We really want to celebrate the art and ingenuity of these cars. Some of them are above and beyond your wildest expectations. The parlor car just went under, went a complete revamp to make it railable. Guns up! And they're off! We're so glad. Oh, we've, we've got Kathy on there too. All right, Shannon and Kathy and Dave and Vicki. We're the number one screen. We've got Janelle Black and our volunteer Orion Racing for our race coordinators. Look at those blind people. Yellow on the other side. The, the other yellow. 
We've got a multi-generation team racing the 1880s, the Sanders family from right here in Santa Rosa. Second time on the rails for them. With this car. Indeed. They have been participating since the beginning and um, I want to give a special shout out because I went all through school with the Sanders kids, Eddie and Becky. Known them since we were all wee ones. And then we have our romance story of last year, Tuka Aww. and Mona. Hand car honeymoon, that's right. Tuka works for the Union Pacific Railroad. He is a real life train locomotive engineer. Comes out of Gilroy, Santa Cruz, Watsonville. Told you we'd get you a real one, folks. Hauls tomatoes, runs paper products all the way back and forth across the country to Florida. Two car. Or not four versus hand car honeymoon. Guns up. And in there off. We've got the sand. It's four on two when the two hand cars pumping. 